Small towns thrive on their early festivals and annual events. These big moments bring communities together, but even more, festivals can help bring economic traction to the town. Our Desmond Matthews talks to city leaders about what they're hopeful for in Eupora. Desmond? That's right, Winston. City leaders in Eupora are hopeful to see large crowds and a big payoff this weekend. We just want to show the area that, you know, Eupora is a place that's having a lot of events right now. Small towns like Eupora usually don't have much going on until weekends like this. The town will host its second annual balloon festival where folks can ride in a hot air balloon. Plus, they will hold a special tournament for a beloved city worker. Rusty was a city worker that lost his life uh, on the job. And uh, it's the community, the churches, they all come together, put on a great event to host and memorialize his life, you know, and the things that he done for the city of Eupora. Mayor Blake McMullen says he's seen lots of growth in the town since last year when the city held its first festival, and he anticipates the numbers to continue to rise. Planning around the Sturgis motorcycle rally also helps. It's been great for the town because last uh, June uh, we had a the all-star tournament here and uh, for the sales tax we hit 55,000. We hadn't seen those kind of numbers in, a, in forever. Yeah, they were all-time highs. But there's something else this year. But one of our newest additions is the Touch a Truck. And this is going to be an exciting event for children to where they can see their biggest trucks that they know or things that they want to get in, like a police car or a fire truck or uh, a bulldozer or whatever we have there. It's going to be really exciting and fun. Events start tonight at 6.30 and festivities kick off on Saturday from 7 until 2.